Hi, this is Asin. You are now watching Asin Math TV. Today, we would like to share how to integrate a cos x with respect to x. In this video, I'm going to use integration by parts. Let's recall the formula. Integrate u dv is equal to u times v minus integrate v du. We can let u be equal to a cos x and integrate dv be equal to integrate dx. When we differentiate u with respect to x, we obtain negative 1 over square root of 1 minus x squared dx. Integrate, differentiate, cancel each other, left only v. And so for the right hand side, left only x. Substitute into the formula and we should have u, which is cos inverse x times x minus integrate v which is x times du du is negative 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 should be positive 1 over square root of 1 minus x square dx for the first term we can rewrite as x times cos inverse x and for the second term i'm going to apply integration by substitution let y be equal to 1 minus x squared where we differentiate y with respect to x we should obtain differentiate 1 is 0 differentiate negative x squared is negative 2x rewrite we obtain dx is equal to dy over minus 2x let's substitute so we should add Integrate x 1 over square root of 1 minus x squared dx is equal to integrate so x is remain here x and 1 over square root of since 1 minus x squared is equal to y so we can write it here y and dx is equal to dy over minus 2x let's simplify so we have x cancel with x no more for constant negative 2 and 1 we can take out so we have negative 1 over 2 outside and we just have to integrate y square root is to the power of 1 over 2 but this is on the denominator part so we should add negative e y so we have negative 1 over 2 when we integrate power plus 1 over power plus 1 remember to add the constant c and we can simplify now so we have negative 1 over 2 times y to the power of minus 1 over 2 plus 1 becomes positive so we have square root of y divided by also positive 1 over 2 plus c 1 over 2 cancel with 1 over 2 so which means that we left only negative square root of y and y is equal to 1 minus x squared so which means that the second term is equal to minus square root of 1 minus x squared plus c. Therefore, integrate of cos x is equal to x of cos x minus square root of 1 minus x squared plus c. And hence, we done. Okay, that's all for this video. Thanks for watching. Hope you like this. See you.